The American people have a right to know, indeed have a need to know, that their president is acting on their behalf and not for some pecuniary or other reason. Uh, that uh, pertains to any credible allegations of leverage uh, by the Russians. Cape Crusader himself, Congressman Adam Schiff, announcing his expansion of investigations into the Trump campaign, the Trump family, Trump businesses, and whatever else he can probe. Uh, in doing so, he leveled subtle shots at my next guest, whom he says was in the pocket of the president. Ooh, here to respond. Former House Intel Chair, Congressman Devin Nunez. Congressman, what do you make of Schiff's charges? Well, it was not a surprise that he was reopening the Russia investigation. But this is clearly an investigation, again, without a crime. We've, we've looked for two years, didn't find anything at all. And what was amazing the other day is we haven't seen the, the, the press people around that much because there's been a whole cottage industry of press people that are in the Capitol now, right? So for the first time, we show up to our business meeting just to organize, and there must have been 15 cameras down there and 30 press people, and I'm thinking, what in the world are these people doing here? Well, we found out because he announced at the business meeting that he was reopening the Russia investigation. I don't know what these people are going to do. This, this cottage industry of press people, they're going to have to go learn code or something, which was Obama's oh, yeah, thing, because yeah, yeah. they're not going to have a job after um, this. Well, they're going to bring uh, Whitaker up to testify, I know, tomorrow, tomorrow who's the acting attorney general. There was some you know, fight. In, I think the administration probably has some executive privilege concerns about him going up there. What can you tell us? Well, I don't know why you would want Whitaker. He's the, been in the acting AG for a month. Or whatever. Any conversations that he had with the president on anything uh, Mueller related, I imagine. But why not bring Rod Rosenstein, who started the special counsel, who it's been leaked that he's going to be leaving? Why would you not bring him in to talk about everything? Uh, Eric Swalwa was on CNN tonight, and even Aaron Burnett pressed him about the myriad of investigations. Let's watch. Are you worried at all, Congressman, about Democrats getting mired in these investigations, not doing other work? Right now, we've got more than 20. I put as many as we could on the screen right now. Um, are all of these worthwhile? Uh, more cannot be less. When I was a prosecutor, Aaron, I'd have defense attorneys come in and their client would have like 10 DUIs and they'd say, can we just make them all go away and he'll plead to one? And I, I would say, no, more is not less. More is not less. I think people are just like, oh, he must be so smart. Now what is that? That screen of investigations. That's the agenda, though. That yeah, is the agenda. Uh, uh, and the Green New Deal. Yeah, our committee, the, the Intelligence Committee, which is supposed to be looking overseas, dealing with places like China and Russia and North Korea, doing serious Bad work. Bad actors. Serious work. We're going to go back into Russia again with no new evidence. Uh, there is some breaking news, by the way, from The Hill's opinion contributing editor. Uh, John Solomon today about a chance meeting, Congressman, between Schiff and Fusion GPS's Glenn Simpson in Aspen last summer. Both men told Solomon it was just coincidental. What's your take? This kind of sounds like the tarmac meeting with Bill Clinton and the former Attorney General. Uh, Glenn Simpson is at the center of our investigation into FISA abuse and other matters. So if the ranking member at the time was meeting privately with Glenn Simpson, who is the main figure in our investigation. He was the one that was being paid by the Democrats to collude with the Russians. So what they were talking about, I don't know, but you can, can you imagine that if I was meeting off the side with some of our witnesses, can you imagine and what Shep they would Simpson have? Simpson lied to the, I mean, Simpson was lying Sim, about Yeah, Simpson you know, lied on, on, on multiple occasions. But I think most importantly though, why would they be, this is a Democratic operative who's, who you know, got paid to do this. What's the ranking member now chairman doing meeting with this guy? And imagine if the shoe had been on the other foot. I mean, they were talking about your meeting at the White House or conversations with the president, but this is a central figure in the investigation. It's like Jeff Sessions meeting Kislyak at a RNC cocktail. Hey, hey, Ambassador. And that was a key meeting, wasn't it? Right. So it depends on whose ox is gored. Congressman, thank you so much for Thanks joining us.